Hello and welcome to this short overview video on ID8 BIMLINK, Type versus Instance Data Management. My name is Richard Taylor of ID8 Software and thanks for joining me today. ID8 BIMLINK is a powerful Revit add-on application that allows you to precisely manage volumes of Revit data easily and accurately. ID8 BIMLINK allows you to extract information from the Revit project and then manipulate that data within Microsoft Excel. You can then pull those changes back into your Revit model for fast, accurate updates. ID8 BIMLINK is your Revit data management engine. ID8 BIMLINK allows you to edit system, project, or family parameters within the Revit model. You can choose to edit parameters that appear within a schedule or even access parameters that are impossible to select when creating a Revit schedule. Additionally, you can use ID8 BIMLINK to bulk rename families and types within your project as well as create new instances of selected categories. ID8 BIMLINK gives you unprecedented access and control for almost all of the data within the Revit building information model. Let's take a look at how ID8 BIMLINK can manage both type and instance parameter information. For my example, I'm going to use lighting fixture data in this MEP model. Let's activate the lighting fixture schedule to better see the gaps within our data. I can then access ID8 BIMLINK via the ID8 software ribbon menu. There are several ways to get started, but I'm going to create a link definition from an existing schedule within the project. I can select the lighting fixture schedule from the list of available schedules already defined within the project. Notice to the right, we have the option to create a link with either type or instance properties editable. I'm going to choose instance to start, but we'll come back to the type-based properties later. ID8 BIMLINK reads all the properties defined within the schedule and it lists them for me on the top right of the dialog. I can choose to add or subtract properties by reviewing the available list of properties on the left. Let's review the list of project-defined parameters. We can quickly filter on only project parameters using the checkbox under the filter selection. I would like to add the project defined property of alternate manufacturer to my list of properties to export. I can either double click on the property or use the add menu button to add that property to my export. I can move it up the list to have it appear next to the manufacturer property. There is a preview of the export below. Notice cells that are white are instance properties that will be available for editing. The gray cells are not available for editing in this specific link definition, but we'll come back to that. A very powerful feature within ID8 BIMLINK is the ability to select properties from other relevant categories. By choosing the room dropdown, we now see all the available properties for rooms. This gives us precise control of many different properties. I'm going to add the room name and room number to my export. ID8 BIMLINK will automatically read geometric room information from any linked model. However, if I select the Include Linked Elements option, this will read light fixtures from my parent model as well as any linked models. For my example, I am only interested in light fixtures from my active model. The sorting and filtering within the link definition will automatically follow what was set up in the schedule, but you can modify that easily by selecting on one of the filters or sorting tabs. When I select on the filter tab, you can see the conditions that were set up within the Revit schedule. Revit schedule filters can only exist as an AND condition, which means that each condition must be met. However, ID8 BIMLINK allows you to uncheck the elements must pass all filters, which creates a powerful OR condition that is not possible to achieve within a Revit schedule. For my example, I want to leave the filter as defined in the schedule where each condition must be satisfied. Now we can select Export to see the results in Excel. Modifications can be made to cells in white. The gray cells are Revit read-only properties or type-based properties. Within the white cell, I can use almost any standard Excel formula to modify the data. I can use all the power of Excel to copy and paste multiple values to cells easily and quickly. I can make changes to the gray cells within Excel, but we will see a warning on the BIMLINK import review. Let's jump back to importing the data into Revit, and we will use a spreadsheet that has already been filled out. After the import process, I can review the messages and warnings from ID8 BIMLINK. 
This tells me that the type mark property was read only for this link definition. However, all other data was successfully imported. Speaking of type property information, let's create a new link definition for the type properties. We can easily complete this by right clicking on the link definition and selecting convert link. This will create a link definition that has the type properties of the lighting fixture schedule available for editing. I can choose the same Excel spreadsheet when I export and IDA BIM link will now insert a new tabbed worksheet into the spreadsheet. When I repeat the process to import the data from my completed Excel file, IDA BIM link gives me the option to choose the appropriate worksheet for import since there are now two worksheets in this file. Once the import is complete, you can see how my Revit schedule is automatically updated in the background. Revit data management has never been so powerful, fast, and easy. Please keep in mind that IDA BIM link ships with hundreds of link definitions. As you saw, we can create link definitions from a schedule, but we can also use one of the many link definitions under the Load Sample button on the main dialog. These sample definitions are organized around discipline and workflows. For instance, we can take a look at the quality control workflows, and we'll bring up device elevations as an example. Notice the definition can export multiple categories, and the recommended properties are already added. However, these can be easily customized for your organization and workflows. Reviewing these sample link definition files is a great way to introduce yourself to the many available workflows and data management processes that ID8 BIM Link supports. We have many available links already defined for maintaining quality control and project standards for your Revit project. Be sure to check out the other ID8 software solutions available for Revit. Our entire collection will simplify your Revit data challenges and increase productivity and efficiency for the entire Revit team. Visit us at www.id8software.com to review online help topics, watch feature videos, subscribe to our blog, and download trials of all of our solutions. I'm Richard Taylor, and thanks for watching.